Hi guys, it's Fufu here. Today I am back with some more OU. I've taken on board your many, many comments and tried to do some changes. I haven't changed it too drastically. Um, so I'll, I'll see what you guys think of this, see how it performs as well, and then maybe change it a bit more. Um, but anyways, what we have here is... The changes are... Um, we've got a Keldo instead of Greninja, just because... I didn't really have much to take on by Sharps. They did like a lot of damage to Greninja, just uh, even though it resists both stabs and everything. And Greninja couldn't, my Greninja set couldn't hit it that hard. So I've gone with Keldeo to make it a bit less scary. Still not a switching or anything if it's got a boost, but um, definitely better thing to take it on. Then, I was running Defensive Sizzle that was not working out, so I've gone with Zapdos. Um, I've given it Thunderbolt and Toxic, and I know that some people like to run Heat Wave. I don't have a Toxic user on my team though, so that's why I put it on there. Um, the issue with changing to, uh, from Greninja to Keldeo, the biggest issue I saw was not having Grass-type coverage. So, I thought maybe having a Toxic user for the... Rotoms would be a useful uh, thing because I know that obviously Resto Chesto is a thing, but it pressures them to do it. Um, and then my last, like, people were saying about switching up the roles of Sizzle and Landorus and saying Sizzle should be uh, like a Swords Dance set or it shouldn't be a defensive set. But then if it's not a defensive set, it doesn't have Defog. So I wanted, I wanted to keep Defog, which is why I went with the defensive Zapdos, and then I'm keeping my Scarf Landorus. That was my reasoning. Um, people were saying use defensive Landorus and then go with something else with Sizzle, but that wasn't going to work because then I wouldn't have anything to remove hazards, so switched up the Sizzle and then kept the Landorus. But we'll see how this goes. I, another concern of mine was doing it this way. I did actually say in the comments as well, I've got a massive, massive Mammoth Swine weakness here. I've got this thing as like it's a check but it's not a counter i've got nothing to switch in on mama swine so that's really scary um but we could also people were saying about making this defensive i don't know maybe i should maybe i should just oh, no because i've got a load more defensive ones this is i could i could try it out right now is what i'm thinking it's just this defense is pretty poor anyways even invested that's not gonna be that high let's see how high it gets invested um, 251. It's rubbish. Its HP is alright, but it's not taking any huge hits anytime soon. But I mean, that gives it mixed defenses, so it might function better. And then this guy's quite especially defensive as well. Uh, my team has got quite a lot of mixed bulk, but the actual walls aren't that strong. That's all I worry about, anyways. But we can try this. Uh, we can try this out and see how it works. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I'm so unsure about this, it's really annoying. I'm not sure, I think I've just got a poor team to start with. What I'm thinking is, yeah, I could change it up quite a lot um, for next time, is what I'm gonna do. Anyways, I don't have anything for this lead. I was meant to give something safety goggles when I very first made this team. I was gonna give something safety goggles, but I didn't. I do have the heal bell though, so it doesn't matter too much of something gets put to sleep. I'm gonna lead with Tyranitar, as he leads with a Smeagol, so... Who do I want to go to sleep? Uh, looking at his team, he's got the Azumarill. That is really scary. I don't even know if Zapdos can take one. This thing can't kill it. Ah, this outspeeds it and can get a Sucker Punch off, but it's not gonna do that much. Um, Lando is going to be important. Do it? Did I? I didn't. I was going to give it Hidden Power Ice. Didn't give it Hidden Power Ice because I have a fast ice user now, so I didn't think it was necessary. I could give this safety goggles. I should probably give that safety goggles instead. Um, let's go into this to go to sleep. Is he just goes to the sticky web? Now I can kill it. Hopefully. I've got the defog as well. That was a bad play. But I mean, that's just what these things do, isn't it? So, whatever. But yeah, let's hope that this Zapdos is better. I like Zapdos. He's a really cool guy. Really cool guy. 
See, I'm so indecisive when I make teams, but how... Oh, he outspeeds, goddammit. Well, I'm just going to defog right now. Just going to defog. He, he, if he makes the right play, he will go... No, that was the wrong play. Do, have I got one more turn of Sandstorm after this? Yeah. So can I just defog right here? Yeah, and can he die to Sandstorm? Yes! Aha! <laughs> yes! I'm happy about that. Okay. So he doesn't get any of his hazards up. Even though I didn't have the proper stop to a smeargle. He didn't have spore, which was not the way to... Not how you smeargle. Okay. The Greninja comes in. I can probably just go into bow ties are cool, right? Oh, but this isn't especially defensive now. I'm going to have to see how well it takes to hit. Ah. Uh... uh... Okay, that does a lot of damage. God damn. Um, so, I'm just going to throw up a wish because he may well switch into the Aegislash. If he goes into Aegislash, he goes for the Dark Pulse. Wanting the flinch, presumably. I mean, even then, the Ice Beam isn't going to kill. So, I don't know. Yeah, that's not going to kill. You saw. And I can just wish protect. I am going to protect it, even though it's blindingly obvious and he can get a switch into something. But no, he does stay in, go for the hidden power, I don't know what hidden power that was. And now I'm just going to... I'll just fire off another wish because he might switch. Why is he staying in? Okay, so we found a poor player for my first battle, which is a bit of a shame. Because it means that we're not really testing this team. He still has the belly jet Azumarill, which could be a real big problem to my team yeah it's gonna be a huge problem uh, that was something that was pointed out in my video last time but I didn't have anything for it I don't know if Keldeo can never hit I'm hoping it can uh, now just throw up a wish again and I'm just hoping I don't get frozen and now I can fire off a hyper voice and that should kill it from there quite easily he might switch out. He's switching out now into the Aegislash. I can get rid of the Balloon, which is really good. That's really, really good. Because that means I can now just go into my Landorus. Get the... Uh, he might be special. He might... Well, obviously, uh, most of them are. I don't know how well it will take the hit. But I don't really have another switch in. I could go into more well, but it doesn't take it on that well. It should outspeed now, though. With this speed, it should outspeed that Aegislash. It's just it's not a particularly nice matchup for me. So I'm gonna go into my this guy. And he goes for the King Shield. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's fine. Let's just go for an EQ. Let's see my King Shield this turn and then He just sacks his Greninja. What? What? I don't know. This guy is using some crazy tactics right here. Some really crazy tactics. Okay, now he goes into the Zard. Um, depending on what it is. So if it's Y, this guy can stone edge it. If it's X, then I might have a problem on my hands. I'm thinking about going into Katarnata as fodder. Because he's not going to be useful for anything else. So I may as well go into Taranata now, as he is Y. That's not a problem. It's not a problem because um, it means I can just go back into this guy. Uh, bit annoying though. As he's switching, that's not a play, and he's just life uh, lefties set. Is that even a set? Is lefties even a thing? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I'm just going to go into... Oh, no, he could go for the play rough. He could go for the play rough. Uh, I'll try and get my rocks up, but he he goes for the aqua jet. <sighs> this guy. This guy. Right, my best play... I'm I'm thinking maybe more while I can go from here. No, it can't because of that thing. But I'm going to go into my more while anyway. Um, get the mega off and just go straight for a play where he brings us in. I've got the Sunbeasted Firefang, so 
as he goes into the Aegis Slash. He does go into the Aegis Slash. <laughs> that does so much damage. God damn it. Um, I do want to Fire Fang here. I mean, but I shouldn't be predicting him like that. Come on, this guy looks. He's pretty. He seems pretty bad. He seems pretty bad, but <clears throat> let's just go for the Fire Fang. I don't. Uh, yeah, he's not weakness policy because he had the balloon, right? Ah, oh, that just dies with a sun boosted Fire Fang. Yeah, I thought he might just attack because people predict the King's Shield. So I got around that one, all right. The threat that's being suspected. I got it right. Okay, now we've got Garchomp coming in here. Um, this might be a thing for Sylveon. It might be a thing for Sylveon. Could Toxic it, but I don't want him. Well, actually, no. Let's go into the zap, the zap dose. This is defensive. He goes to the stone edge, though, predicting that. That was a good play. Life Orb. Good knowledge. Good knowledge. Now, do I sack this now? Do I sack this now or do I go into this? I may as well sack this now and then go into my Sylveon. Nothing, can, nothing appreciates a high... What? It's got crunch? Okay. I'm going to have to hope... That, oh, well, no, I can just go into Keljo, what am I talking about? It's Specs, though, so I'd have to lock myself into something. I'd rather just keep my Keljo, because it can clean up. If I get some damage on this, I can just clean up with Hydro. Well, Hydro, Hydro probably takes it out from that. I don't know, I don't like relying on Hydro. I'm going to go into this now and Hyper Voice, because it will kill this. Probably. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, that dies yeah hyper this is why i love sylveon as a wall because hyper voice is still really powerful i don't i don't know how much this is going to do i'm going to store some sun turns maybe i, sh I don't want to sack anything i don't want to sack anything i'm going to see how much this does oh wait, i'm not especially defensive now so this is going to be a two hit ko but i can maybe i no i can protect now can't i, I oh crap Okay, he goes for the solar beam. Um, there's an, I, I need to protect right here because the fire blast will take me out. He goes for the dragon pulse, what? Does he not have the fire move? Is that the level I'm playing at right here? I can get rid of the sun. It said immune, it even said immune when I used protect. Oh, this is annoying. Okay, so I'll have to get another battle after this one. Hyper voice does nice twenty three percent resisted from a wall. It's pretty cool. So let's just go for a wish. Fi he does have the fire blast. Why wasn't he going for it? And now, now that the sun's gone, I might be able to stall him out. And he keeps missing the fire blast. That's pretty poops for him. Uh, <clears throat> uh what? What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so looking at that, the Fire Blast would be a 2 hit KO, but maybe not after lefties. Air slash. Oh my god. Such bad luck. I'm, I like being. Uh, I like being. kind and I like acknowledging the hacks in, because people get pissy and then I'd rather people enjoy it. Did I not. Oh, I just. I wasn't meant to wish that turn. Oops. Now this guy's gonna come and wreck my day. Uh, okay, this will be interesting to see. I'll go for a protect. That could be a bad one. He might, he might have the SD. I don't know. I'm just gonna go for a hyper voice. May as well. May as well. Okay, the went for protect. He's going for the EQ, but this might make him overpredict right now and go for something else. He goes, yes! Oh, okay, defensive Sylveon is the way forward. I take back all of my words. Yes! Why is, oh, this was on a different account. That is why, GG. Okay, I'm gonna switch over to my other account where I'm not gonna be playing people at the very bottom of the ladder. That's why it was confusing me. Because I'm on a 1500 rating on this account. Um, okay, <laughs> let's try it. Let's try a better battle. Oh, I'm not gonna win this next one.
Okay, rain team. I am so not ready for rain. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I doubt he's going to lead with this. I doubt he's going to lead with that. I think my best lead might be. He might lead with it. Zapdos might be my best lead. Yeah. Zapdos takes on his whole team pretty well. He does lead with the main electric. I kind of thought that might be a thing. So I can just toxic. He might go into the Aegislash. Slash. I can take Aegislash Slash on reasonably well, can't I? Volt Switch does not that much. Seeing as I'm defensive, not especially defensive. So it will be good to see what he goes into now. He might go into the Dragonite. He doesn't really have much for this. So that is good. Ah, he does go into the Aegislash. Slash. Right. Right. Um, I'm going to go straight into my Landorus then. This is not a good play. Why do I do this? Because I know that they have Shadow Ball. Ah. Why do I do this? Why do I do this? Does he have rocks? He might have rocks on that. And now he's going to go for the sneak, probably. So, I could go into a sneaky more well here. Could. That was such a bad play. Ah, I'm just not used to the tier yet. Uh, let's go into more well. And get another Intimidate on. So that... Okay, he switches. He goes into the Toad. He's got the rain up, which means that my fire fang won't be doing anything. He could just try for the burn here, or he could be specs and do a lot of damage. Either way, I'm not very happy staying in. Uh, he's either going to go into Aegislash or stay in. I want to go into Keldeo. Oh, Keldeo, I'm going to have to rely on a lot. Oh, no. He does go for the Scald, straight for the Scald. And he gets the bird, which is a bit annoying. I have a Cleric, but that's a bit annoying. Um, I think this is my best play. His best play is probably to go into this, though. Ah, or maybe he's just going to stay in. Ah, oh my god, he did the thing. Okay, this has got to be a problem. I'm going to go into oh, this, because I don't think he can do too much to it. He had the Flash Cannon as well! Oh, I didn't know that they carried Flash Cannon. I thought they carried Sacred Sword or something. God damn, this Age of Slash is wrecking me. Just get a bit more lefties. And then, this isn't the only thing that's not destroyed by it. I need to sack at this point. This is just not good. I need my Sylveon to be at better health. And this guy is probably really important too. He doesn't... So, looking at that, he may well not have the sneak. Because he would have gone for it against my Landorus, right? Right? I don't know. I don't know. How well will this guy take a thing after the sun? Probably not well enough. Uh, uh, is he going to change it up? Ah, and what items does he have? Is he weakness policy? Oh god. I'm gonna predict him to go for a shadow ball. No, he goes for another flash cannon. Fuck! Aegis Slash is wrecking my life! Uh, should I go for rocks or EQ? Um, I need damage on this thing. Let's go for an EQ. No! Ah. He can't switch out because he know He does switch out! For fuck's sake, that was... If I could have got it then. If I could have got it then. Oh my god, I'm playing so freaking badly. I just... This team has got me all over the place. Okay, this out definitely outspeeds me. So... What do I have for this? I want to keep this guy around because of the weather. Ah, oh, and this being burned as well... I have nothing, I have nothing, I have nothing, nothing, nothing. I have nothing. Uh, okay. Let's go into this and go for a toxic. 
No, let's go for a T-ball because he might bring this in again. Okay, blood survives. If you get the burn, I'm gonna roost now, and that's fine. I can just T-ball here in case he goes into this. He doesn't have. Did he have lefties on his? Yeah, he didn't have lefties on his thing. He goes for the thunder. Oh, I didn't think he'd stay in. What am I doing? No. Is he gonna go for the thunder again? I have to go into this. No. Yes, he does go for the thunder again. Yes. I get to earthquake something, maybe. I'm gonna U-turn though. Please go into Dragonite. <laughs> Oh god damn it! No, he's probably gonna. S okay, he stays in. What's he going for? Crap. Oh, I'm gonna have to sack this now. This is so bad! I do survive though. I can waste the more rain turns. Uh, that's just hyper voice. There's no point protecting. And he's not gonna switch to Politoed this turn. He's definitely just wanting to get this kill right here. Definitely wanting that. So the U-turn did 38%. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. Okay, he just goes for another hidden power. I'm not sure about that. So I can go into this guy again. And just go for another U-turn. He's probably well aware that I can just go for another U-turn. So I could... Knock off won't kill from there. And he probably wants to keep this around, so I am just gonna go for a knockoff. <laughs> what what am I doing? I make I don't even make sense. I'm so confused right now. This guy's plays I, like I could have got him. That was my worst play was switching this guy in on the first turn because I just I I don't know. I haven't played OU enough and I know that every Aegis Ash carry Shadow Ball, but I just don't, when I start playing, I just don't. It's because the, literally the last time I played OU, the Shadow Ball set wasn't really a thing. Like, I don't think it people had known. And so it was right at the beginning of Gen 6. I haven't played since then. Uh, and then just, I could have pursued the Aegislash. It would have died. And this thing could be dead already without having me having to set the Sylveon and keeping it for fodder for later. Ah, uh, just annoying. I could have had a lot of things. But anyway, I'm gonna check if this is lagging right now. Well, I definitely should have lost that one. But that was the learning curve. Um, okay. So, my team is kinda weak to Aegislash. Kinda weak. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. The ones that carry flash cannon anyway, which I I don't know how common that is. Probably very common because they just invest in special attack and then have the sneak as well. I don't know. I kind of want to get one more, but what I'm thinking of doing now is um, just like playing on and then maybe uploading some of the more interesting battles I have. But maybe not. I might just ladder for a bit. Um, but uh, yeah, please leave in the comments what you think of this team, what I've now let myself be really, really weak to, what I've exposed myself to, and what is good about the changes, if you think that I've done anything right as well, because that would be cool. But as I said, please look to see if someone's already commented like 50 times on what you're suggesting, because I, I probably won't respond to you if you are just suggesting something that has already been suggested. Anyways, I've been Fufu, you've been awesome, and hopefully see you next time. Bye.